Hello everybody, SigRev2 back again with another video for you all and today I figured I'd be doing something a little bit differently than normal. I'm going to give a review, oh, but this time it's not going to be any ordinary review. No, 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 sirs, as you can see, I like G Fuel a little bit. And earlier today I received in the mail the brand new G Fuel flavor inspired by XQC, the juice. Unfortunately, I tried recording a review of this just a few minutes ago. OBS wasn't recording. So, I already have drinking it. I've already put it in my glorious shaker here. I've already done the kit and caboodle. So, it's not going to be as fresh as, you know, as first try as I would like it to be. But, it's still going to be a review Nevertheless, still going to be very refreshing. So, first things first, good pop. I do like, first things first, really love the color of this. It's a really nice, vibrant, dark-ish pink. And, I don't know, it, it looks very, very, I already said refreshing, but it, it's the best way to describe it. And the smell, it smells just like fruit punch, because that's basically what this flavor is. It's fruit punch... Um, but it mainly focuses on the watermelon and the citrus aspect. And I'm not a big fan of watermelon, but let's just sip and find out. Oh. That's that good shit. You definitely get the watermelon first and foremost. That's gonna become apparent as soon as you put it to your taste to your tongue finger and normally i'd be worried like oh man it's gonna be watermelon it's gonna be overpowering i don't really want that but then you get this citrus coming along for the ride and it meshes really damn well <laughs> together with the watermelon in a way that's really difficult to describe it's like a, the nice it's just like a nice mellow blend of the two flavors and the parts of the watermelon that I don't really like in a flavor kind of cancel out because of the loveliness of the citrus. I don't really know exactly what kind of citrus it is. I'm assuming it's like just their standard like grapefruits and oranges and whatnot. And then as you swallow, you get the fruit punch coming in on the back end, which, you know, provides a nice smooth mellowness as it goes down and it's refreshing as all hell i would gladly go back to this again i would put this in my daily rotation no problem and i wasn't expecting to say that when i got this like i got it when they announced it last week because this dropped last week i received it today for 10 20 21 whatever the date is whatever the date is for you guys overseas i think it's 10 4 whatever Oh yeah, they dropped it last week, and I wasn't able to get the collector's box, unfortunately. That sold out almost immediately. Like, as soon as they announced the link, like, it was gone. So, I got that. I ordered it first before I really realized what was in it. And I saw the watermelon, and I'm like, oh no, I don't really like a watermelon. Because when I, my first G Fuel that I ever got, I got Hype Sauce, and I got the Classified Flavor, which they had for a BOGO deal last year. Like, that was when it debuted. And that one tasted like just overpoweringly sweet watermelon mixed with like bubblegum, vanilla. It tasted like like fake wa watermelon gum. And I couldn't finish the one bottle I had of it. It was just too much. I didn't like it. And there was another flavor. I forgot exactly which one it was that I've tried from somebody else. I don't know if I have it or what's going on with that. But I couldn't. I, I couldn't enjoy it there's something about melon flavors especially watermelon i'm gonna keep harping on that i do apologize i don't like to repeat myself but you know this isn't scripted this is just going as it is this is the flow this is the flow this is how my brain works and if you like it you like it thank you for watching so much so i was expecting this to have a lot more of that flavor going in. But no, that, that's really refreshing. It's really nice. The flavors mesh together in a very satisfying way. And honestly, 
I think at the end of the day... I think at the end of the day... Sorry, I, I was looking at the expiration date on the bottom because I didn't even realize that they had these on the bottom, on the tubs. At the end of the day, I'm going to have to give this, out of a scale of five, I'm going to have to give this a four out of five. Yes, ladies and gentlemen, four out of five for the juice. And also because I wanted to show it off, this is the brand new sticker that comes along with it. Lovely springtime floral design. I might have to give that to my mom because she really likes doing flowers and stuff. So I think she might like that. But that is it, guys and gals and everyone in between. Let me know what you thought of not only the flavor, what do you think about the juice, but let me know what you think about this video, if I should give my thoughts and opinions on the other flavors, and hopefully this time it'll be, you know, actually me preparing the drink. And, well, you know, I had a great time. I can't wait to record another video at some point. Might do a music review, might do something else. You never know. And... With all that said, hope you have a great day. Thank you for watching. Don't be a stranger. Peace out.